if you're using AI to code, are you even doing it the right way? Cornell University and the University of the Peloponnese just broke it down, and most people have no clue. Bookmark this video right now, because this is the kind of insight that'll make you 10 times more effective in the future job market. These researchers discovered two totally different ways people are using AI to write code. First, vibe coding. You guide the AI, like talking to a coding buddy. You prompt it, it gives you suggestions. You edit, you test. It gives you more control, more creativity, and it's great for learning, prototyping, and exploring new ideas. But the AI is not driving. You are. You debug, you decide, you own the process. Second, agentic coding. Here, you give the AI a goal. It figures out the steps, writes the code, runs tests, and even fixes bugs. It's like an autonomous developer that just gets things done. You lose a bit of control, but gain massive speed and automation. What did the research find? Vibe coding. Better for creativity, flexibility, and personal control. Agentic coding. Best for automation, scalability, and repetitive engineering tasks. But here's the kicker. The most powerful developers will use both. Vibe for ideation, agentic for execution. That's the future. Tag your smartest friend, the one already experimenting with AI tools. Follow me if you want to stay way ahead of the curve. And remember, bookmark this. You'll want to rewatch when AI becomes your next coworker.